Yo, what's good cryptocurrency fans out there welcome back to the everything altcoin channel today we're going to be talking about saddle guys this is looking like a pretty good project right before we get into talking about that i would like to ask you guys to subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already we're on the road to 10k subscribers so if you guys would like to help out with that and join the 10k giveaway hit that red subscribe button don't forget to like the video comment anything in the comment section down below and most importantly hit that bell button and get notified every time i upload a new video and lastly, check out the description down below for the Discord and the Patreon. Also, the Patreon has a new tier regarding private sales, helping you guys get into some private sales with me. So if you guys would like to learn more about that, just join the Discord and ask your questions and we can move on from there. And let's get right into the video, guys. So Saddle came out on Pokestarter not too long ago. Um, it had a decent launch and now right now it's pretty it's pretty much down from like its all time high. As you guys can see, it has about a one million one million dollar uh, trading volume and then 10 million dollar market cap so it's a fairly low market cap meaning it has huge upside right and then once you see the vcs and everyone behind it you will understand why this could have some crazy upside right uh just about a month ago you know it was at all-time high three cents is down 69.9 percent right and i do believe that it could go on it's just that when we had that little bear market it actually did get hit hard so let's go look at its website Sado is a web3 foundation grant recipient i mean they are a polka dot project guys right that uh that pays nodes and p2p network instead of miners or stakers delivering a permissionless and scalable network capable of powering decentralized versions of twitter facebook and uh and amazon without the need of predatory monopolies in the network layer guys so they're looking to tackle a big problem right now in the decentralized space for basically version uh twitter facebook and amazon versions right so that is pretty big and once you see the backers you'll see why a lot of people like this project as of right now so it has powerful applications saddle powers games communications tools social network apps and other other data and bandwidth incentivize applications and like i told you guys this is a part of the polka dot ecosystem they got that web3 uh, uh grant uh saddle application comes with full support for polka dot and other th leading web3 blockchains right proper economic elegant economic design that solves fundamentally uh, fundamental scaling problems then you have an open infrastructure saddle funds the rollout of infrastructures for other networks as well as its own you got a vibrant community you got enterprise pk support app deployment peer-to-peer -peer web 3 toolkit this is a pretty uh, pretty important part libraries that support everything from qr generating uh, generation and scanning to zkp based gaming functions so scrolling down as you guys can see as a simple web 3 development it is truly peer-to-peer -peer, scalable on-chain data all the all with the tools you know and love guys and then lastly you could browse applications without metamask you got about 40k transactions per day and it's growing then they got 10 million transactions and 30 plus app, uh, popular applications and modules right and this is their uh basically their roadmap here and I don't see where it says like where we at in the roadmap as of right now. Uh, I feel like they could fix the roadmap just a little bit more, add you know quarters to it, so we know exactly where we at in the timeline of the roadmap. But this is the big important part I wanted to tell, I wanted to show you guys. Their supporters, people that back this project right now. You see some big names here already. You got the A195 Capital. You got OX Block uh, Dream Ventures spark digital capital ngc uh scrolling down a little bit more au21 block sync ventures lotus capital haka is probably something that you guys probably don't know about but it's like um the ceos of certain uh polka dot projects came together and made paka i know crust is a part of it um i just forget the other teams but then you have moonwell you got master ventures here guess what uh, one of our favorite projects this genesis shards um signum capital as you guys can see they just got a bunch of big backers behind this project so this makes me fairly interested in this project and how it develops in the future now let's go look at the team here are the two team members here as you guys can see these are the co-founders david and richard uh basically their team is based in uh beijing I don't know how to pronounce this so i don't even want to try it but it's based in beijing and 
they're the two co-founders and then you la you have uh clayton here also as a part of the team uh the team right now let's go look at some applications that they have on uh saddle saddle actually has some games and other applications um scrolling down a little bit uh you can see you got the application type so you got broadcast apps applications embedded data and transactions and broadcast them onto the network peer-to-peer -peer, uh, peers listen for updates then users the blockchain allows the secure exchange of data in situations where participants need an open network but indicated read slash write data sharing then you got the peer-to-peer -peer apps so peer-to-peer -peer applications use Sato to automate and on Chiffy Hellman key, uh, key exchanges and manage their key list and IP address. Sato provides a fallback communication layer when off-chain and peer-to-peer -peer relay fails to work, but most of the application data is transferred off-chain once peers have connected through blockchain. The users, peer-to-peer -peer vision of WeChat, uh, WhatsApp, Instagram, and other social applications, along with applications integrated off-chain, cryptocurrency payments, and, and or enabling transfers between parties on money protocols. As stack-based apps, peers uh, peer send and receive instructions, which are added to the stack in order in ordered fashion and execute in sync. Uh, uses l2 blockchain smart contracts vms and more complex applications that require consistent distributed state and order execution code right so as you guys can see they have a bunch of applications on this on this whole thing so this is looking like it's going to be a pretty big project in decentralizing the internet and that's pretty good to us man let me know what you guys think so far i broke down this whole thing of saddle for you guys uh, basically saddle right now is very low in market cap at 10 million dollars um it's just sitting at one cent right now at you know it's down 7.1 percent on the day so i do believe that there's going to be some upside to this uh it could definitely get into the hundreds of millions of market cap when that would happen who knows but this is something that should be big for the future but let me know what you guys think about saddle leave your thoughts in the comment section down below and if you guys haven't subscribed already yet please do so we on the road to 10k subscribers so if you guys would like to help out with that hit that red subscribe button don't forget to like the video comment anything comment section down below and most importantly hit that bell button to get notified every time i upload a new video and i'll check you guys later peace youtube